Good morning. We are back on trail today after our zero in Helen yesterday. Um, again, want to thank Haley for picking us up and uh, bringing us into town. And we now Colleen. And Colleen for <laughs> driving past the road close sign so that she could get us back to the trail. Colleen's with uh, AMC Taxi too, so if anybody ever... If you're ever in the Helen yeah. area or I guess any of these areas down here, super yeah. friendly, yeah, give her a call. But yeah. All right, and now for the long awaited anticipated story that I was going to tell you guys. <laughs> so we got dropped off at Hog Pen Gap. This morning. This morning. So the other day we stayed at Whitley Gap and then we Return to Tasnidi Gap, which is a half a mile farther than if we would have just left Whitley Gap and went uh, further down the trail, 0.2 miles, and then we could have got off at Hog <laughs> Pen. Again. But we were, it was, that's all me. It's all me. I should have been, I should have looked at the map more. I didn't know that it crossed the road. And so now, today we're going to hike back to the Whitley Gap sign, touch it, and turn around, and, and come, come back. right back. <laughs> so we're gonna have to do some backtracking miles, but yep. that's okay. Yeah, so that's, that's why, that was my big, big blunder. We're not experts, we don't claim to be. We're just out here doing yep. our best. Just living life. All right, well, we'll see you in a bit. It literally was a, a five minute walk. <laughs> Not even. Instead, we went that way the other day for like 20 minutes. But here, here we are. Time to get the day started. today. It's snowy. It's cold. It's really beautiful. But even though it's snowy, I don't know if you can see that, but still little signs of spring. getting really down on myself and just I was having a bad day because I'm pretty slow on these uphills I didn't you know hit the gym before this I didn't train or anything I drink a lot of beer so I'm not in the best shape yet but So my new thing is that I'm just gonna keep telling myself, even though I'm slow, even though, you know, 
Kevin shoots right up this thing. Even though, you know, people are passing me, I still make it to the top. So I'm just gonna try to keep reminding myself that I can make it to the top. I'm just a slow moving vehicle and have to let people pass sometimes. So yeah, see, Kevin's already all the way up there. But yeah, slow and steady. So we're coming on a portion of the trail that it looks like the, the ground is all melted, but the trees haven't melted. It looks pretty cool. I don't, I don't know if you're gonna be able, if you're able to see what it really looks like on video, but pretty cool here. I'm glad that we got to <coughs> see a little Appalachian winter wonderland. <laughs> You know, getting getting the best of everything. The sunshine, the fog, the drizzle. Yeah, the drizzle, the winter wonderland. And it's only been a week. It's felt like a month, because we're having such a good time. Look at the, the snow shadow left on this tree. Clearly it's heated up quite a bit everywhere else for it to all melt, but not that spot. It's pretty cool. This is like a wintry green tunnel. We're, we're like looking at this tree and uh, this guy's like, literally grasping onto everything to to stay on it reminds us of um a tree back in washington called the uh, tree of life if you guys ever want to look that up it's it's really cool yeah To Blue Mountain Shelter. Um, again, there's like, I don't know, probably eight or nine people in there, so can't really show you. I'll show you guys what it looks like though. There it is. You got the privy down there. You got some bear hang, hangs. Should have a pretty good sunset. No. But it's a, it's a pretty busy, pretty busy here tonight. Um, yeah, I'm gonna smoke a cigar, we'll cook dinner, probably call it a night. You are
better than uh, what is it? scrambled bonito <laughs> and mashed potatoes. Yes, <laughs> definitely. finished with day nine and we went 12.1 miles today we are at where are we blue mountain shelter blue mountain shelter oh, yeah. um from hog pen gap is where we started we started at like 10 a.m today and got here around 4 30 ish yeah it's currently 38 degrees and dropping. It's inside the tent. Tent's a little bit warmer. As you can hear, there's a lot of people here tonight. Yeah, it's um, chilly today. <clears throat> we'll be prepared. Um, today was really awesome though. It was pretty easy, 12.1. It was easy, but there was... Um, it was really flat. There was those, all those steep parts. There was like okay. three or four yeah. really they steep. They were sprinkled in there. And it, there was a couple of spots that were very rocky. Yeah. But it was still fun. Yeah. So yeah, you got anything else? No. Me neither. All right. Um, yeah. Well, we'll go uh, Thank you for everybody. As we're closer to 500 subscribers, I'm sure I could still like 100 away, but we wanted to do something special and um, do like a giveaway or something when we get close, or if we ever do. <laughs> yeah, so. But yeah, anyway, for everybody that's watching um, back home, uh, thank you for everything that you guys are doing and uh and we miss you yep and everyone who leaves nice comments below thank you very much yeah they make my day they make me smile you're good people <laughs> all right we'll see you all Anyways. tomorrow <laughs>